The battle over Costco's proposed chicken processing plant continues, this time in the city council chambers. Opponents hope that their legal challenges will stop the process, while backers say the city council support should make the plant a reality. Motion carries 7 0, Mayor. Motion carries 7 0, Mayor. Motion carries 7 0, Mayor. Unanimous city council support for a chicken plant lacking unanimous public support. Have you thought what it's going to do to Fremont and to neighboring small towns? When they're coming into our town and we're bending over backwards and it feels like they're just reaching into our pockets and grabbing the last dime we have. The most contentious issue of the evening, a $1 million economic development grant approved by city council. It's essentially free money for Costco if it keeps its promises to the community. Money some people want to see reserved for small businesses. My concern is that we're giving to Costco at the expense of other business opportunities and growth opportunities for Fremont. And why would a company the size of Costco need? I feel that it's a two-way street. They're investing in us, so we need to invest in them. The revised plan includes a larger than anticipated $275 million plant on this property south of Fremont, $5 million more in tax increment financing, totaling $18.3 million, and extending the construction timeline, opening the plant for business in March of 2019. And all the time. Communities are not fortunate enough to have a, a facility of this magnitude come knocking on their door. It doesn't happen every year, decade, century, and for most communities, it will never happen. And there's one word that comes to mind, suckers. Costco's a smart company. They know we're a desperate city and we need them. Costco says the chicken plant will bring 1,000 jobs to Fremont and boost the city's economy, while opponents say the kinds of jobs that are being offered will only hurt the quality of life here. In Fremont, Dave Roberts, KETV, Newswatch 7.